find so many worthy textiles in the thrift store. I want to make something beautiful with it. I also found all of these handkerchiefs. I also collected them throughout the years. I've had quite a big collection. I actually have quite a lot of them. So I'm going to be using the lace and see what I come up with. This is where I am at the moment. I don't know about the bag. I like this. I'm not sure about this. Yeah, I'm not sure about this. Um, but I do like the front very much. It looks a little bit Elizabethan to me. So I really like it. I need to make sure that this is right in the middle. Um, I like the combination of crochet and linens. I found these uh, end panels, uh, I don't know, panels, it seems to be from some kind of a skirt or something. So I'm thinking of adding them at the bottom as well. Okay, so what I've done now is I have attached some of these handkerchiefs together to make this kind of uh, panel and I quite like it at the back of the dress so I'm thinking I'm gonna carry on stitching stitching here more more panels and um, see if I can make it even more higher or even start from here attaching more panels and then just go all the way down yeah I quite like that I'm happy with that. So I have stitched um, this side here to make this side and I have stitched this panel here but I don't like, I don't think I've done a good job there so I might have to redo that again. Um, what I've decided to do is to carry on attaching more handkerchiefs uh, to come down here. I'm going to have to stitch this one here. But I'm thinking of making a V here. So attached all of them like that. And then the skirt starts from there. Day two. I'm very happy how the dress is going. Uh, it's very, very nice. Uh, it has a little bit of a very antique style. I really love it anyway. So today, we're going to be stitching the underskirt, the skirt that goes underneath the crochet for the skirt part of the dress. And hopefully I'm going to be finishing the, 
the bodies and uh, maybe hopefully put it all together. I'm really excited. I still have a few hours of work, so hopefully we finish it today. Let's do it. So this is the, the body so far. I've stitched this and I've made this uh, bustier part with this beautiful edges sewn together. I'm gonna iron this and then stitch this bit here and the sleeves are gonna come down here. I'm still debating whether to use this crochet here because I also found this beautiful lace. It says one and a half meters, 1.9 meters. So I don't know whether to use it. This is from my stash again. I don't know where to use it like this, but it would look really beautiful or there or underneath here. I'm going to have a look and a play with it. This has been quite an involved top. So this is where I'm at at the moment. I'm really happy with um, the top itself. I show you what I've done here is um, this is the top it has all the folded um, handkerchiefs I use a lot of the scallops of um, the edges which is very pretty and uh, I'm playing around with this lace but I think it doesn't do it doesn't go well because what I'm thinking is I'm going to attach the skirt with some kind of ribbon. So I found this ribbon, which is quite beautiful. Also in my stash, very, very old. And I'm thinking, I think it looks better with the brown. And this white here is too nuclear, it's too bright white. So I think I'm going to finish the top like this and then I'm gonna try to uh, finish the overskirt um, and they all will be uh, three different pieces so the top is one piece the underskirt is another piece and then the overskirt the brown with the lace uh, crochet is the top skirt so early morning third day this is where I'm at the, the bodice is almost done. Um, I made the tags and I used lots of the edges from the handkerchiefs. Quite beautiful. But I think it's very empty here. So I'm thinking I am gonna put one of the corners here. Like that. One of the corners there. And I think it will look much nicer. So that's what I'm doing now. Okay, so this is as much as I'm gonna go with the undergarments, the top and the underskirt. I think this is quite beautiful. I'm very pleased with it. Um, that's how it looks underneath. It would have been nicer to um, have a little bit more office fabric to make a more um, um, fuller skirt. But in here, I'm not gonna lie, it's not closed properly. And the reason for it is that um, I don't know the measurements of my daughter, so she needs to, um, yeah, she needs to uh, try on and see what to measure. I'm going to put some kind of um, uh, lace in here to close the top and then some pretty buttons, I think, in here. Yeah, and uh, obviously put either zip, um, sorry, um, elastic here or tags in there. So at the moment, this is how I'm going to leave the skirt and the top and I'm gonna <clears throat> and I'm gonna finish the, the look with the overskirt with the crochet so 
this is it for now. Um, it's not finished yet. I still need to do the corseted and um, laced at the back of the top and some buttons on the collar. I also would like to put more fabric on the underskirt and make it fuller and then just simple waistband. Um, I also would like to buy some cute little pearly buttons to see if I could just hook the crochet like that because I think it would look gorgeous and then carry on the pearls and maybe do a little bit of embroidery. But I must say, I am super happy with how it turned out. The handkerchiefs have played such a pivotal part in the project. Um, I use all of the lace and lots of these color pages and I kind of Frankenstein patchworked my way around the top. Um, I think it's beautiful. Um, I said to myself, the challenge of making something beautiful with discarded textiles, you don't know how I picked these things from the thrift store. And uh, I think I have accomplished that. Um, I think it's beautiful, it's not finished, but it, if I carry on this video could probably be a couple of hours long. So I'm gonna try to uh, park it for now, get the stuff that I need and then finish it, the fitting and the embellishments. So um, anyway, I'm very happy with it. I hope you enjoy it. Um, if you wanna come, um, come back and see another project from me. I'll be bringing you stuff very soon. So please subscribe and um, like the video. Thank you so much.